Today we're looking at this Wi-Fi 6 repeater from Strom. And what it does is basically extends your wireless in your house by adding an extra node in. You can actually buy extra ones as well on top so you could have two or three of these running together and they will extend the wireless into spots around your home or office that you normally don't get internet to don't get me wrong it's not going to speed up your broadband at your router but it can potentially speed up your wireless access throughout your house and give you a better range altogether the Strong Repeater AX3000 UK is a powerful Wi-Fi 6 extender designed to enhance your internet coverage with ease. Capable of combined speeds of 3000 megabytes per second, it ensures seamless connectivity across both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bands. Additionally, it can function as an access point enhancing your existing Wi-Fi network without the need for a new modem. Security is also robust with WPA2 and WPA3 protocols, providing safe and reliable connections throughout your home or office. The front of the box displays the product's name, an image of the device, and highlights the full year warranty. On the back, you'll find a list of key features and specifications, as well as a QR code that directs you to the product's website for more details. Inside the box, you'll find the repeater and three sets of paperwork, and that's all you need to get started. The front of the repeater features the strong logo and three indicator lights, one for power, one for Wi-Fi, and one for secure device pairing, indicated by a lock icon. The antennas are positioned on either side and can be retoted within a 180 degree arc, allowing you to direct the signal where you need it the most. This flexibility is particularly useful if your plug socket is at an angle or lies flat. On the back, you'll find the plug, along with product information, including the setup password, and in our case, this was admin. One side of the repeater features a lock button, a one gigabit network port for wired connections, and a reset button. Otherwise, you have a lot of holes all the way around the device for airflow to keep it cool. Before setting the strong repeater up, Keep in mind that it extends the range of your existing internet. To do this effectively, place the repeater at the edge of your current Wi-Fi range, somewhere it has still got a strong signal to amplify. Avoid placing it in a room with no signal, as it can't extend what it doesn't receive. For optimal performance, avoid placing the device behind obstacles like bookshelves. If you're dealing with multiple dead spots around your home, consider upgrading to something like the Strong Mesh Network System, which uses multiple nodes to create a more comprehensive coverage area. Okay, now to the setup procedure. It doesn't mention this in the manual, but we always recommend you restart your modem router first to clear any errors or issues. Usually you do this by removing the power cable from the back of your router or in some cases there is a power button and allow it a few minutes for it to fully reboot before proceeding any further. Next plug in the repeater. I would start by plugging in your repeater near the modem router you want to extend from. You can move it to a more suitable location after setup. Once plugged in give it about a minute to power up. Now you need to connect up to the repeater to set it up. So on your device, whether it's a PC, laptop or mobile phone, go to your Wi-Fi settings and connect it to the strong repeater. If the setup page doesn't automatically load, open a web browser and type in the address 192.168.1.254. You will then be prompted for the setup password, which is found on the back of the repeater. In our case, it was admin in lowercase. Next, you'll be prompted to choose between setting up the device as a repeater or an access point. Most users will want to select the repeater option, as this allows your network to function more cohesively. Setting it up as an access point might prevent access to other devices on your network, like printers. Then follow the on-screen prompts to connect your repeater to your Wi-Fi network. 
If you're unsure about the network name or password, they're usually found on the back of your router. Once the connection is established, your device should start working together seamlessly. Finally, go to your Wi-Fi settings on all the devices you want to connect via the repeater. If you see the option for 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz, choose the 5 GHz for a faster internet or 2.4 GHz for a greater range. Whether you need better coverage in a specific area or want to enhance the overall performance of your existing Wi-Fi, this device offers a reliable and straightforward solution. In conclusion, the Strong Repeater 3000 is a solid choice for extending your Wi-Fi coverage. With its user-friendly setup, flexible antenna positioning and robust security features, it's a great addition to your home network. I hope you enjoyed this video and know I did. Why not check out one of our other videos by clicking this box up here or this one just down here. Otherwise, you can give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you think and we'll see you next time.